been waiting, or you could say I've been dreading uh, this day for 26 years. When I say dreading, the most beautiful thing is to walk your daughter down the aisle, and I've succeeded in doing that today. The second thing is to do this speech. Um, family and friends, as I look at my daughter today, the bride, I can't help but reflect on all the years we've been lucky enough to watch her grow up and reflect on the girl she was and the woman she's become today. Olivia, as beautiful you are on the outside, you are also a happy, bubbly and beautiful person within. She captured my heart on the day she was born, the 1st of April 1991, and she was my little girl then, and she's now grown into my little princess. But Olivia, today, as I watch you marry a wonderful man, I'm filled with pride and I'm confident that Olivia and Gavin are about to embark on a wonderful journey together, filled with love and happiness that only can come from a man and wife. As I look at this beautiful woman before me in a studding wedding gown, and I know we are truly blessed, but ladies and gentlemen, doesn't she look absolutely stunning? And Gav, I'll translate that for you. Gert blush. <laughs> <laughs> Olivia was a gift from God to Yvonne and I. I will always be extremely proud to be given the honour of being called her dad. So ladies and gentlemen, please be upstanding and give a toast to my beautiful daughter, our beautiful daughter, Olivia the Bride. <laughs>
But to add to this, he also has hundreds of friends as he's, and he's known everywhere we go because Gavin likes to make a new friend and will speak to anyone, anywhere we go. But this is why I love you. It does go on. You are the person who can make me belly laugh all day, every day. The person who will laugh at my jokes and act that, that with me. Who will never let me be in a bad mood and always, or will always bring me around within minutes of being in your company. Don't get me wrong, you're by no means perfect, <laughs> but you're my little bit of perfect. That's all I have to say. So if everyone can raise the grass to my lovely husband, Gavin. <laughs>
Yeah, I couldn't do anything without you. I love you.